the switch up day. And I'm not going to tell you what day it is. <laughs> it's prior to Saturday. And I'm just prepping for um, packing, getting all the things done that I need to do to get ready to go on my trip. You will see this on Saturday, though. So happy Saturday. <laughs> there we go. Everything's good. Um, so we're going to do all the usual things, sort of. The bag switch is going to be a little bit different because you're kind of going to see the bags that I'm taking with me and swapping into one of them, packing the other one away, so on, so on. So anyway, that is where we are. It's been a week. I've had a lot of just work things to deal with, and it's just been kind of a, it's been kind of a week. So note to self, if you're going to go away, take some time off before you go away, because you're going to need it. You can't, you can't do you can't do both at the same time so you need at least like a day in advance and I should have taken a day off after but no I'm coming right back to work the next morning so I'm coming home late Monday night going back to work first thing at six in the morning the next morning so real real wise Nancy but you know that's just kind of how things are done around here uh so nail check that's the wear and tear on the green, which I anticipated cream. Um, that's just how things go. If you don't use a topper, I ended up not putting anything on top other than the coats of um, this color. So had I used that clear one, then maybe we, we would have a, a better, um, you know, turnout here. But Regardless, we're going to change out of this, pick another color, pick fragrances for the week, which will include things I need to take to Chicago right now <laughs> and what I'm going to be carrying next week. So it's, it's, yeah, it's going to be an interesting different one. I'm going to point you into the suitcase and show you what I'm throwing in there for my trip. And just yeah, going going forth and seeing how how things are gonna go, and hopefully I don't forget anything that I need to take with me. I doubt it. I feel, I'm literally taking like more things than I than I need to take, but I'm that kind of person. I I want to take my entire house with me. So I will see you over there. We'll wrap it up at the end as we usually do, and you will see this when I'm not here in Oregon. <laughs> so I'll be right back. Okay, so you can probably tell what I last used. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't bother to put it away. Um, so yeah, we had a rather successful week. Granted, it's not the, been the full week yet, but um, you know, almost. We're like two days, two days away from it being the full week. But I got to prep for changing this out for the trip. So wore everything. Um, good good assortment. I may keep this one out because I can use this in my carry-on and then one other one for travel, but I'm not quite sure. But um, lovely rose scent, as I mentioned. Great vanilla as my go-to. This is a clean and crisp just body spray scent. I usually wear this like on the weekends. Um, yeah, just kind of a thing. And then I brought out Passion de l'Amour and <laughs> I got, well, I'm going to tell you, it's, it is a very rich scent. Like I, I don't have to spray this more than like twice and it just wafts and it stays there for a long time. If you have a, a, if you spray this accidentally, I should say accidentally, purposefully, if you spray this on like an outer coat, I had a coat for one winter, I wore this and that coat had this scent on it literally all season. Like I had to actually go take it and get it cleaned to get the smell out of it. Um, it, it lasts, it permeates. So you have to really love the scent to, um, appreciate it, but it definitely, I, I would never probably, I should say never probably, I, I know I would not buy a full cupcake because this is more than enough and it comes with how many have, we're in here. It comes with um, three total vials, so one's in there. 
this I think is often on the um, sale part of their website for about a hundred dollars, um, maybe 150 more, more than enough scent. You can get away with this. And I think the little atomizer is really, really cute. You can change out to different fragrances, um, really easily. It's just a really pretty presentation. They've got like a dozen different colors. So if you're considering House of Siage, I would go with the travel sprays before investing in a full size cupcake. If you don't know the scent yet. I'm going to find out some fragrances for the next, next week. Okay. So here is the tray of the week. I'm, I've got travel and I've got, um, things I'm going to wear. I know for a fact at home. So let's go clockwise. Uh, vanilla sky tried and true favorite. This is for home, uh, taking contra moi as, um, a travel spray for the trip. Uh, also going to take my cool baton um, from LV and probably going to pack this one as well for a clearer, uh, clean scent. So this probably be like on the flight, both ways, less intrusive scent. And these are more intense. So that's, what's going to stay on my body then. And then coming back because Halloween will be next week. Um, yeah, the 31st. So that would be what Thursday, this, uh, pumpkin spice latte, my emerald rain, fragrance is back out for that event so again for home for travel and this will be the tray of the week i have to give you a sneak peek of the chaos that is the cloth right now i've got pajamas out i've got toiletries cash <laughs> more toiletries the felices over here this is this has got to be cleaned up and then i'll get to purses at some point and then to go over here i've got on this chair like shoes i'm planning on taking socks battery packs packing cubes all that fun jazz and we'll come back over here did i mention that my macbook my macbook pro last week um caught a virus so i had to run out and buy a brand new one because I didn't have time to fix the old one and take it to Geek Squad and all that stuff. So the fastest solution was buying a new one. Yeah. Uh, and the suitcase over here. So suitcase, the Ricky's in here. Um, maybe taking that sweater dress. I, I just got it. So I have to try it on. Um, and then we got to start packing. So yeah, we're, we are in like chaos mode. Everything's just everywhere there's a mess in the closet oh i forgot to tell you so that's that's what i'm talking about the the chaos i've got gift miss stuff over there piling up i've just got boxes dust bags it's it's yeah this is the this is the chaos and there's the ring light there's the the chaos right now there's just so much crap everywhere hopefully this will become organized here in the next hour or so we'll start getting it into the suitcase this will look a lot less messed up and I'll show you the bags I'm taking besides the Ricky um, to Chicago. Of course, I forgot to mention. Uh, so I'm swapping out of that and I'm going to utilize this rose gold flake clear coat. Let's see if I can get this out of the box. This will be the, the polish of the week. So it'll be it will not be anywhere near this a tenth. It's going to be basically scattered. But I figured that would be the best solution, low maintenance manicure for the trip. So that's what we're swapping into. Okay, the next dilemma, besides the dogs barking like crazy people, is carry-on slash personal item. So my plan was to take the Neverfull, I, you know, I have to unpack all my work stuff out of it because it's massive and I can put everything under the sun on there, but there's no security. So I've got Reed Creek Off uniform bag, extra large burrow. Lots of compartments, maybe hard to get everything I need 
carry on wise. We crank off the smallest of the three, but it's got a large zipper. I could close it up pretty well. And I think worst case scenario, if I needed to leave it open and stuff it full, I could probably get almost as much in here as what I could get in the never full, um, like up to here. Obviously you could pile this up high. There's no strap for the never full. The reed has a shoulder strap. The burrow has a shoulder strap. So I'm pretty, pretty, I'm pretty close to leaving never full at home just because of how heavy it would be. But this is usually my go-to bag. But I could save some wear and tear on it because, you know, kicking it under the seat and all that kind of stuff. That worst case scenario could go overhead in the bin. This one as well could go overhead in the bin with, you know, all the sealed compartments. So, I'll come back. Okay, I just realized that I've already packed away the Ricky into the suitcase, but I told you that, right? Um, so we're going to take Felici with us to Chicago. So I'm going to keep my wallet, take out my trash. Yeah, so get that all taken care of. Put this away. So Felici is going to go in carry on with me so I'm gonna leave the spare the spare one here take the actual wallet take the dust bag pack it up and put it inside carry on because I don't want it getting stolen in checked bag although you know if I'm putting the Ricky in there I might as well put this one in there too but I'm just being paranoid. So we're putting Felici away. And then, so Felici is going. I am taking, let me grab her off the shelf. I am taking Cassie. I've been wanting to carry, carry Cassie for months now, ever since I got her. Um, just excited to have that. So this is the, this is my purse for the trip. Um, and I think I've decided on the burrow as the other, the carry-on, because the burrow can double as my bag on Monday. Because as I check out of my hotel, I still want to shop and do some stuff around Chicago. I can carry that bag as a purse and not feel too frumpy. And then it'll be my carry-on to go onto the, the airplane. And then I can put the casting and everything into either the burrow or into the luggage so Cassie Felici I'll bring her back out so Felici Cassie burrow Ricky that's four bags do I need a fifth do I need a fifth do I bring a fifth I'm kind of thinking I want to bring the dragon fruit just to just to have a bright pop of color. But do I need a do I need another bag? I think I have enough. I I think I have enough. I'm gonna buy a bag. I'm gonna I'm gonna buy a bag while I'm there at the real real demons. I don't know. I'm buying a bag. I don't know what it is, <laughs> but I'm buying a bag. So if I need another bag, I will buy a bag while I'm there. So I, I'm good. I'm good. So these are the two bags that I'm taking with me on the plane. The burrow will be the thing encompassing all of it. The Ricky will be in check luggage. So we have a plan. This, this lovely item will be the bag of the week. I am so excited to carry Cassie. I, I'm so excited. Thank you, Jolie. Thank you for selling her to me. I am so excited. decision has been made. I decided to go with the burrow because it could double as a handbag, although it needs some, needs some love down there, but it's, you know, it's dual purpose. So handbag slash carry on. I've got to set up my air tag for inside the suitcase. 
Um, yeah, so we're getting there. Well, that's been an adventure. <laughs> um, yeah, so I tried on like two of my outfits and they aren't going to work. So I really should have ordered those things sooner and tried them on sooner. I don't know why I waited to the last minute. I have backups. I'm fine. It's, it's going to work out. Everything's going to be fine. Um, I ended up doing, as I mentioned, this very simple, very demure, <laughs> as, as, the, as the kids are saying, um, very mindful, very demure. I'll probably do one more coat. Um, this is just one, but probably one more just to have a nice coverage. Um, but yeah, no, I just got to get the, um, final things in the suitcase. I am taking so much stuff. I'm, I'm not going to have even enough room to bring home stuff. I'm, this is pathetic of me, honestly. Overpacking, that's just what I do. So, anywho, I will check it when I get back. I may have some stuff on Instagram. You might have already seen it at this point because, like I said, I'm building this before I leave <laughs> for the airport. Um, yeah, so... I hope you've had a great week. I hope you have a great week ahead and um, we'll see what I bought. I don't know. Let's hope I don't spend too much money. <laughs> I know I am. It's going to be fun. I'm excited as I'll get out. So I hope you all have the greatest week ahead and I can't wait to, to talk to you all next week. So take care. Bye.